patients interested in being on the liver transplant wait list, they'll have to first come in for a transplant evaluation. That includes some lab work, testing, and then meeting with our transplant surgeons, our social workers, financial, and the whole group of the transplant team. This allows us to assess if you're an appropriate candidate to be on the list for liver transplant. Almost everyone on the liver transplant waitlist is a candidate for a living donor liver transplant. Um, the best thing to do would be to start looking for donors early so that we can get those donors in and get them evaluated. This allows us to transplant patients when they're healthier and allow for a smoother recovery. Patients can be proactive in their health while on the liver transplant wait list by eating a high protein, high calorie diet to maintain their weight, keeping up their physical activity, uh, coming in for visits to see their hepatologist regularly, and letting the transplant team know if there are any changes in their condition so that we can take good care of them while they're on the liver transplant wait list. Patients who are actively looking for a living donor should start the process early. UPMC provides a living donor champion toolkit to assist patients in finding a living donor that is appropriate. We also have living donor champion events and your transplant coordinator is always there to assist you in the process of finding a donor. Advantages of living donor liver transplant include that the family and the patient can be involved in the process of finding a living donor, and this brings families and patients hope. Additionally, living donor liver transplant patients can go into surgery healthier and therefore have a smoother recovery after transplant. PMC has the experience and expertise in living donor transplant. Our Living Donor Champion program helps patients to find a donor, and at UPMC, we're committed to helping patients through this process.